Signs your life is about to undergo huge changes. Signs by the universe that your life is about to undergo changes. No matter how diligently we strive to maintain stability, there inevitably arrives a moment when circumstances appear to unravel. We find ourselves grappling with a sense of powerlessness and disorientation as everything seemingly crumbles around us. Yet, if we shift our perspective to one of optimism, we'll recognize this as the conclusion of a challenging chapter, heralding the arrival of brighter days ahead. Change remains an unyielding force, one we should embrace without trepidation. Here are three indicators signaling imminent transformation and urging us to persevere with unwavering hope. 1. Feeling off the track. Initially, you were aware of the direction your life was taking, but if you now find yourself uncertain about your path, fret not. Rest assured, you're already journeying towards discovering your true calling. Embrace the journey, as your life is poised for a certain and positive transformation. 2. You don't feel the same way. As you mature, it's natural to outgrow certain aspects of your life. What once held your affection may no longer captivate you in the same manner, and priorities that once held significance may shift. This evolution is a testament to your personal growth and development. Understand that it signifies a phase of life in transition, and there's no need to be alarmed. 3. The Synchronicities Synchronicities are occurrences that happen concurrently, seeming significant but lacking any direct causal link. They serve as subtle hints from the universe that you're on the correct path. Your emotions, actions, and circumstances are all harmoniously aligned, propelling you toward your enhanced self. If you begin noticing the prevalence of the number 5 in your surroundings, it signals an impending significant transformation in your life. This number symbolizes the necessary change awaiting you, a change that promises to utterly transform you. How to deal with an over-friendly neighbor Here's how you must deal with an over-friendly neighbor. Each of us likely has that one neighbor who, while well-intentioned, tends to be overly enthusiastic. Although their excessive friendliness can occasionally be irksome, navigating such situations can be challenging. To address these concerns effectively, here are some tips on managing interactions with overly friendly neighbors. 1. Make it quick. If you're aware that your neighbor tends to delve deeply into conversations and exhibits overly friendly behavior, aim to keep your interactions brief. Avoid offering unnecessary details and maintain a courteous demeanor. However, it's essential to remain polite as you share proximity with them. Politely excuse yourself after a few minutes, citing reasons such as having another commitment, a looming deadline, or a scheduled video meeting with superiors. 2. Reschedule conversations. Feeling uninterested in engaging in conversation with your neighbor is perfectly acceptable and quite common. However, considering the shared living situation, occasional interaction might be necessary. When they come knocking, you have a couple of options, either refrain from answering the door, explaining later that you were resting or feeling under the weather, or greet them briefly, mentioning that you're currently occupied with a video meeting, and propose a designated time for a more leisurely chat. You can then extend an invitation for tea on a different occasion to fulfill the social obligation. 3. The Roommate Discussion Now, if you choose to fib, it's crucial for your roommate, spouse, or parents to be on the same page. Keep them informed about the details of your conversation, particularly if you anticipate that the nosy and overly friendly neighbor might interrogate or bring up your deception in front of other household members. 4. Discourage the food exchange. Certain neighbors may have a tendency to bake or cook dishes and share them with their neighbors. While this gesture is initially appreciated, it can become burdensome when reciprocation is expected. Particularly if you don't share a close relationship with them, it's essential to gently discourage this behavior. Express your gratitude for their kindness while respectfully conveying that you prefer not to participate in this exchange. It's important to maintain a courteous demeanor, acknowledging their thoughtful gesture despite your personal preferences. 5. Drop Hints during those unavoidable conversations, whether over tea or in the park, subtly convey that you're not particularly inclined towards social interactions. Share details about your busy schedule to illustrate your limited availability, 
hoping that they'll grasp the message and reduce their insistence on engaging in lengthy discussions. Women anonymously share their hottest sex escapades. Find out some of the hottest experiences. Sex encompasses pleasure and desire in various forms. It's often said that there's unparalleled intimacy in connecting with your partner on a sexual level, where two bodies unite as one. Thoughts of passionate encounters can be highly arousing, stimulating your imagination. To provide insight into this experience, here are five women anonymously sharing their most exhilarating sexual encounters. 1. Ropes and Ties At the age of 23, I had my initial encounter with bondage. Contrary to common assumptions, it wasn't excessively rough. My partner displayed precisely the level of dominance I desired. Ropes, blindfolds, whips, and other elements were involved, heightening my arousal to the fullest. 2. Foreign Escape You've heard all the hype about how romantic French men can be, right? Well, I got to witness it firsthand. During my year and a half in Paris, I began dating a French man who truly knew how to work his magic. Our moments together were incredibly passionate, whether in bed, in the kitchen, or even the bathroom. It was an utterly amazing experience. 3. Sex Dreams After a disagreement with my boyfriend, we spent the day in silence, each retreating to our own beds for the night. During that time, I had an incredibly erotic dream where we indulged in hours of passionate sex. Upon waking, I kissed my boyfriend, and we proceeded to have the most incredible intimacy we've ever shared. The connection was intense, filled with amazing foreplay and mutual exploration. I find myself wishing for such dreams more frequently. 4. Sex on the Beach Once, I met a guy I'd been chatting with online. The date started off poorly as we struggled to find common topics to discuss. However, after a few glasses of whiskey, I found myself drawn to him and initiated intimacy. We hastily departed from the cafe to head toward the beach. Sitting on a secluded platform, we engaged in mutual oral pleasure. Despite the riskiness of the situation, the thrill of the moment was unparalleled. 5. Sex while being pregnant When I was two months pregnant, my doctor cautioned us to avoid overly vigorous sexual activity. However, consumed by my surging hormones, I yearned for intimacy with my husband. Despite the advice, we engaged in sensual lovemaking while he held me from behind. It was an incredibly memorable and passionate experience. Not every woman chooses to engage in sex during pregnancy, but I cherished it as a personal triumph. If you enjoyed watching this video don't forget to like subscribe and turn on the notification bell, so you don't miss any new videos. Let us know your thoughts about this video in the comments section down below and feel free to stay and enjoy it until the end, also make sure to check out our next highlighted video and we will see you next time. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe.